Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome to another episode of Spitting Venom, aka The Venom Vlog. And today we're going to talk about something that you guys brought to my attention. Uh, I think Comic Boys was the first uh, person to, to link me this. So uh, there's a link to Bizarnage website or something. So I'll put the link to Bizarnage's Tumblr account, uh, to Comic Boys down below. And I think one of you uh, also sent me a link to comicbook.com. And uh, that's what I saw when I did like my Bing search. I saw like comicbook.com pop up. But uh, as I said before, I don't typically like to use some websites uh, for information. And I'm not even sure I believe this 100% uh, so this is just something to you know you guys take a look at it see what you think let me know what you think of it in the comments this is not something that I could confirm anywhere or find any like you know proof if this is real or not and it does make sense I mean usually you know six to seven months in advance you'll have some kind of products in the works uh, you know you want to put uh, the, the they want to put the Venom logo on stuff to make sure you know people see it at the grocery store so they're you know constantly thinking about the Venom movie they want to get the name out there but at the same time there's a chance this movie might be rated R and if that's the case I find it interesting that it's getting this kind of marketing on a soda that you can find in an aisle that kids can walk down. And now granted, there is going to be Venom toys coming out in the toy aisle, even though they're not associated with the movie. They have, they still are based on the character from the comic books, uh, and those characters are still very intense characters. So it's it's possible, it's 100% possible for this to be real, but I'm not a, I'm not really sold yet uh, because you know. Usually Sony wants to have a lockdown on everything. They want the first image of Venom to get out there to be very specific. They want to control it, you know, the best they can. Obviously, you see how they are with this movie. It's, it's something I say to ad nauseum on this channel, which is they play this movie very close to the best. Uh, they do not want anything out there that they don't want out there unless it's like, you know, apparently people speculating on certain things. They're like, eh, whatever, let people speculate. Uh, but when it comes to something like an image going out, they want to be the ones to release it. Now, I know leaks happen all the time. Sony's very familiar with leaks for sure. Uh, so this could still be true in that regard, but I'm, I'm still hesitant to believe it fully. Uh, but regardless, here's the image that was shown. Uh, this is going to be a brisk tea, apparently, uh, uh, allegedly, <laughs> this is going to be a brisk tea flavor that's coming out specific for the movie to promote the movie. And it's dark cherry limeade, I believe. And the most interesting thing about it is that it is the image uh, of Venom is on the bottle. And now the reason why I'm a little hesitant uh, about this is because the eyes. Now everyone said, oh, look, the eyes match. That makes me believe it. The fact that the eyes match from this to the image that, you know, we've seen before on the t uh, trailer poster makes me believe that someone took that and then Photoshop the rest around it and then slapped it on like a, a brisk tea bottle. Uh, so that could be someone who works for the marketing team that did that, or it could be someone on the internet doing it as a April Fool's joke and it just took an extra, you know, couple hours to get out there before it gained traction, uh, before you guys came across it and before you brought it to my attention. So I'm still not 100% believing this is the real thing, uh, but if it is, it will certainly, I think, uh, you know, probably quiet a lot of the people who are, you know, just being hateful on this movie just to be hateful. Uh, and they're saying like, oh, Venom's going to look stupid. This movie's going to be a, you know, a screw up. If this is what he kind of looks like, uh, um, that's a that's a solid image. <laughs> like to me, I feel like that will silence a lot of people and make them go, all right, I'll give it the next trailer. You know, even though I think a lot of people are already going to do that anyway. But if, if that looks pretty good, I think the image looks pretty solid. And that's also what makes me a little hesitant about it is that it looks really good. And I'm like, oh, I, I want the movie to look that good, but will it? Uh, so, you know, I'm trying to be I'm trying to be half, you know, uh, foot in and half foot out on this one. Uh, but I do want to let you guys or I want to see what you guys think about it, because a lot of you guys have been writing me going, hey, what's going on? What did you see this? Did you see this? And it's like, yes, I saw it. You know, I got enough comments about it. So I wanted to make this video. I'm uploading uh, right now or I'm exporting right now my Venomverse video. And so I figured while that was exporting, I'll upload that to YouTube. And then I'll edit this and put this up for you guys uh, so that it's up as quick as possible. So let me know what you think down below. I'm still hesitant. I, I don't want to fully dive in and believe this just yet for the reasons I stated. But it is still pretty cool. And someone, uh, if it is fake, they went to a lot of hard work to make it look as authentic as they could. And so big salute to you guys. Uh, Brisk is owned by Pepsi. And it would be interesting to see Pepsi, the company, uh, promote a movie like this. But I'm still not sure. Uh, but I will say if it's Dark Cherry Limeade is coming out, and has whether it has a Venom logo on it or not I want to try that because uh, those are two flavors that I really really like uh, and then I think the bottle like it actually looks pretty cool it's like a dark red kind of carnage looking which is kind of neat so uh, yeah I don't know let me know what you guys think down below thanks for watching my channel as always like share subscribe all that fun stuff 
I'll see you in the future. Peace.